What's up everyone? I'm Timothy I'm Miles Jr. You're watching Miles Messiah and thanks for tuning in, checking out this review. Um, today I am doing Soda Jerk. Um, oh, what was that? Um, I got root beer and orange cream. So I don't know if, the, if they labeled the brand Soda Jerk Shot or they're just advertising taking a shot. Um, as you can see here, shot. Soda, jerk, root beer, shot. Oh, <laughs> well, I'm an idiot. Um, I picked these babies up. Give me one moment. At or Oak Grove Liquor Store on Mil in Milwaukee, Oregon, on McLaughlin Boulevard. Um, they have a ton of. Uh, Great flavors, great alcohol, uh, different products. If you're looking for a variety of like cool, intricate bottles and other things like that, um, or you know, just these these uh, very rare type alcohols that you can't really get anywhere else, uh, they got a lot of those things in there because um, you don't you don't find them in like your typical uh, podunk. Uh, towns that have a liquor store they just you know those are very generic you get your whiskey you get your vodka you get your rum and you get the fuck out you know what I mean uh, so this place offers a lot more variety of uh, different uh, brands and um, interesting bottles and stuff like that anyways these the soda jerks were $35.95, so $36 for these. They're both 35% alcohol by volume, uh, 70 proof. They don't really tell you a whole lot of anything about the product or the brand at all. So it's just what it's labeled as, and that's what you get. So we'll start with the root beer. We'll get into it. Oh, oh. So it's just a twist top, nothing special, no cork, no nothing else. They're just, you know, they want to get their product out there to the world and that's, they're just doing it. So this one smells nutty. No root beer flavor whatsoever. Or scent. Hmm. I want to say it, it tastes more like the little root beer barrel candies that you get. Uh, rather than actual root beer, but I can kind of taste the root beer flavor. I think if you added ice to this, um, you might get more of that soda uh, root beer flavor that you might be looking for in a root beer flavored product. But I really doubt it. Um, but it isn't bad. But it tastes like alcohol, so it isn't um, dangerous you're not gonna want to chug this um, I can see maybe after like three or four shots you might start chugging it um, because then the sugars and stuff might come to the forefront of your taste buds and you'll forget all about uh, the alcohol flavor but overall it's not a bad product it's pretty good all right now next up we got orange creme cream Shot. Let's just get into it and go from there. Again, they're just trying to get their product out there. It's got a cool color, especially in the sun. <laughs> looks like it's glowing. Oh, this is really what it looks like over here. More like that. There you go. This is just 
you want to put a light underneath it and let your alcohol radiate throughout your house and people come over and go whoa what is that and you're like it's alcohol and they're like oh it's not water and food coloring I smell cream that is all I can smell I smell absolutely no orange at all and I don't smell any alcohol so this one could be dangerous So this one is strong in the alcohol uh, flavor. The fumes really come out in it. Um, and they do burn slightly. It doesn't, however, taste like orange, not even like the generic orange flavor. But it does have that like milky, creamy flavor to it. But it does not give you what is advertised here on the bottle. So I think they really dropped the ball on this flavor, especially this one's pretty close, but I think overall they did kind of fail with what they were trying to sell us. Um, so overall, is the product worth the $36? No. So I would recommend that you don't get these unless you absolutely want to go against my opinion and try them for yourself and waste your 35 bucks, um, then go ahead. But uh, collectively and overall, both these are, this one's slightly better, but I'm gonna slap them together with um, the Soda Jerk score um, collectively. So overall, they're getting a 6.8 out of 10. Um, that's your review. I'm Timothy Almond Jr. And until next time, fuck off.